Hello everyone and welcome back to BlenderDiplom.com. I'm Gottfried Hofmann and I got a good news for you. That is a new release date for Blender 2.8 and that is July 2019. And you might wonder why this would be the real thing when the developers couldn't make the original release date of October 2018 and neither could make the second release date on April 2019. Well, we're here in Germany. We have a saying, alle guten Dinge sind drei, which you can translate as, if you do things several times, it usually works on the third try. So there is the third re release date, so this should work out. But I have a um, few more assumptions why July should be the actual release date. And that is, during this week in Amsterdam, a lot of Blender developers from all over the world came together for one week of planning and working on Blender 2.8. That was the so-called Blender 2.8 Homestretch workshop. And that means that this time the planning is a lot more solid than the last few times. So what did they plan? Let's go backwards. In mid-June, 2019, the bug fixing phase should start and the bugs will be prioritized. So the worst showstoppers will be fixed first and the easier or smaller ones should be fixed later on, maybe even in 2.80b. And that also means that um, when you see this phase starting and when, it, when it's in mid-June, you can expect a release soon because that's usually the final phase before release. And um, before this phase, the documentation will be updated. That's planned for the first week of June. And let's see whether this is gonna happen. I'm pretty positive about it. And um, the idea is that all those developers who created new features for Blender 2.8 should make sure that they are well documented. We have the Blender official Blender documentation and that is where you can expect everything. And of course, also in the Blender 2.8 release notes. So those would be the two main sources of documentation and the developers should make sure that by the first week of June they start updating it. Then we have mid-May, there's planned the UI polish, which means that all the smaller things in the current Blender 2.8 UI, all the paper cuts, um, they, are, well, they want to try to fix them. So um, the UI polish, it's not meant to introduce any more big changes to the Blender UI, like for example, the introducing, introducing of the monochromatic icons or the introduction of icons in the toolbar. No, just smaller fixes. So the UI is more consistent or um, is less blocking and everything. So by the end of May, beginning of June, there shouldn't be any more changes to the Blender UI, which means that would be the perfect month to start learning Blender 2.8. And another pretty cool thing is going to happen in mid-May, and that is the Python API code freeze, which means that a lot more developers will start porting their add-ons to Blender 2.8 because they don't have to worry anymore that the API might change until release and they just would have to do the same work again. So pretty good times ahead. And this was just a very small overview of what is planned. If you want to know a lot more about that, I suggest you watch the Blender Today live episode on the new release date. Link to it is here in the end screen. If you're watching this in the mid of April, you might even be able to ask the developers question directly in the live stream. If you're from the future, I'd still um, suggest you watch it because there will be a lot more information about the release planning than what I could present here. And if you like, updates on Blender 2.8. Stay in touch with Blender Diplom. Please hit subscribe and ring the bell. And as always, do try this at home. That, uh, that's why I put the links to Blender 2.8 builds into the description.